Alright, hey YouTube, JV here. Um, sorry I'm posting a video while getting been busy with school. Um, but fear come at y'all with a uh, quick little update video and a project, start of a project series. So, um, if any of y'all know about, um, like, uh, lawn sweepers or, like, DR Leet, lawn Leet, the leaf vacuums, lawn leaf vacuums, etc., etc., You'll know that lawn sweeper run you about two, three hundred dollars, and the you know the lawn vac runs well over a thousand. So I got the idea. You know, whatever I should build, I'm gonna build my own um, lawn and leaf vac. So you know, I have this John Deere, and then I have the bagger system um, that came with it back here. Um, you know, it has these two for it and everything, and the bagger thing sits on the back. Um, and you know, most of those lawn and leaf vacuums, as I mentioned, provide suction. And that's mostly because they have such a big trailer. And so you can get in it and carry the hose out and go to different places. So, um, that, from the deck, you know, when this thing's up here, the two comes up about right here. So it comes up pretty high. So that got me thinking, I had this trailer. I thought about building a box to sit in, like a little enclosure, in the, having the tube go in there. But that wouldn't give a whole lot of capacity. So, I'm going to build a trailer that's low to the ground. And the tube will come to here, and it can basically just fill up um, full of leaves. And hopefully, I should build it. I have about everything except the wheels, like tires, to do this um, about on my own. I guess are pretty cheap. So uh, I found this old weight machine. I've taken it apart. Um, it was somebody was about to throw it away as part of a weight machine. Um, so I thought, you know, I'm gonna take this home. I could use it for something. So, and lo and behold, I'm using it for this now. See the harness? It got some nice bearings, bolts. This thingy that I may or may not be using that in there. That I'm definitely gonna be using that box tubing. But um, these right here are gonna be my main rails. Um, measure the trailer. These are gonna be the long, the long, um, lengthwise rails right here. These two tubes are. They're thick enough my welder can weld them, so that's good. And these two tubes are gonna be the sideways, and then I'm gonna use some of that box tubing over there for um, in between braces. So, you know, not a whole lot to it. I haven't been able to. I haven't really started on it yet. I'll do more videos on it, but. Essentially, you know, that'll be, these will be my main frames. Have it low to the ground. I mean, the clear from, I want the bottom of the frame to be about, and let's see here. From compared to the tire, I want them to be about yay, yay high, you know, so it can get a lot of capacity. Oh, hey, there's Mr. Tom's dog out there. <laughs> what are you doing down here? Oh great, he's going, he's using the path in my yard. Try better, you get him. Anyway. But, um, yeah, so, I'm gonna, later, tonight or tomorrow, I'm gonna start, you know, cutting this up and hopefully starting to weld the two and then I'm gonna figure out how to build an axle and everything, but, um, yeah, I just figured I'd come out to y'all and... Somebody say my name. Anyway, um, yeah, so, I'm um, just gonna, I'm gonna be working on that. I'll definitely make some more videos on the, how it goes, but, um, give it a rate, comment, subscribe, etc., so you know the, the more gist of things, but adios.